Just letting you know about a little thing I did on holiday. I went to Utopia the other week, and you know the country Utopia. And people, <laughs> people, people often say to me, they say, you, 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 "Utopia was nice, but what are the people from Utopia called? Idiots, Utopians." <laughs> so that's E T O P I A N S. Yeah. Susie, is that made up word in the dictionary? Uh, nearest you get is Ethiopian. <laughs> <laughs> really, it's quite a good joke. This. I've even got a very old one. This is Shakespeare's actually chewed pencil. <laughs> it's so chewed, I can't tell whether it's to be or not to be. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need to be here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here for the of the job. Not because I've got tax bills that haven't been paid for ten years. <laughs> <laughs> so don't have to do that with me. I've been on the dead on Polish show. <laughs> <laughs> You're not laughing now, but I guarantee that'll be the one that you wake up at three o'clock in the morning and go, <laughs> to be or not to be. I <laughs> <laughs> oh, will, anyway. And I'll turn around and I'll go, do you know what I said tonight, love? Oh, you left me years ago, didn't you? <laughs> I've actually brought along my nan's ashes. <laughs> and uh, genuinely true, my nan was always a big fan of Countdown and she always wanted to come on. And so this is like. <laughs> uh, is that, is that's that... genuinely my nan's ashes. It's not, though, is it? It really is. <laughs> well, can, we have, can we have a look? Don't joke about with it, because it's genuinely real. Oh, dear me. <laughs> Admittedly, it's a whole head just pushed yeah. in. Which <laughs> is not to to say. My thermos flask keeps hot drinks hot and cold drinks cold, but how does it know? <laughs> there's going to be a funny answer to that one. What is mm. it? Are you asking me? Yeah. Bob, there's going to be... Um... <laughs> oh, is it the flask question? Yes. yes. Oh, that's for Lee. Yeah. <laughs> I'll ask my nan. <laughs> okay, Lee, you're eight. Reglazer. Mm. <laughs> yeah, right to the flat. Amazing. Uh, Reglazer's in, but not Reglazer. Well, hang on, who's doing the work? <laughs> <laughs> if you can reglaze, somebody has to have that profession. Glazier reglazes. Reglazer. Well, what's a glazer? Somebody so, glazes. Yeah. Mm. So a re glazer, somebody if you break yeah, your glazer, yeah, you just get I'll the just same get the glazer R back. You wouldn't get a you wouldn't get a glazer. <laughs> you do the job. You only glaze once, can't you? you no, no, no. I come from again. a I was born in a very rough part of the country. There were so many broken windows, it became a profession. Reglazing. <laughs> <laughs> While well, you've been arguing about this, Susie wrote the R on the end of it in the dictionary, so it's now officially in. <laughs> yeah. 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 Really well, I don't like to be like this, cos, but, I mean, countdown rules are very important. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite in my nature to say, I would love it to be fine and it would be great, but, you know, oh, they're How so... About... <laughs> Tough on the rules. But if rules are unfair, then they should be changed, and I feel like the world should reward people who tried really hard, and that's Lee. I feel, I feel both pleased and patronised at the same time. You're not going to accept the Australian town Will Nukri, are you? <laughs> All right, in that case, four. I'll go four. You've got a four, so I'll two go. fours over here. I don't suppose you're going to take the Yorkshire Darts champion Will Nukri, are you? <laughs> Welcome back. The answer to the teaser. The words were tit rides. The clue was what a mess is, of course, dirtiest. <laughs> Chucking me arabos, I was trying to catch him in my gobby at the interval. As <laughs> there. That's what I've won it. In the interval. <laughs> I'll have another one, Susie. Go for the. You're better at the long throw. Oh! Whose book was that? Um, that was the uh, Lee Mack biography. What's that? What have you done? Nothing. <laughs> I was reading it, but once I read it, I was just drawing the evidence. <laughs> it's not like you to be shredding paperwork in case you get followed on with it. <laughs> <laughs> just my accountant said it'd be a good idea, yeah. <laughs> Got puzzle, teapot, Pulitzer and opulent, none of which... <laughs> Can't do any of them. <laughs> uh, and a very, quite, a, quite a frightening word, output. You could have put out. I put out someone's window recently, and guess what? <laughs> <laughs> guess who I phoned? Oh, 
The re it's in, it's in the dictionary. Right, now time for Lee and John to go head-to-head. -head. This numbers round is just for them. OK, John, you're to pick the numbers. Come on, Nana! <laughs> <laughs> you're not going to revive her, Lee. <laughs> This is the one. She better bring me some luck. <laughs> Plus the nine, 39 times by 10. Yeah, 39, 390. Oh. 10 points to Lee! <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, what? I thought you had to use up all the numbers. Oh, oh come yeah. on! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you can do it using all the numbers. Can you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, why don't you piss on my bonfire? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that word cropped up recently, and this is why it's because my... Uh, I don't know if I mentioned, but my window smashed recently. <laughs> <laughs> and when the reglazer came round, I said, what exactly are you doing? He says, I'm reuniting the window with the window frame. <laughs> You are not just clever, you are one of the cleverest re-glazers I've ever met. <laughs> and he was from Utopia. He was the best Utopian re-glazer. <laughs> uh, it says here that you uh, pulled out of the Paris Marathon when you discovered one of your legs was slightly shorter than the other one. That is true, yeah. You're not going to get a lot of sympathy off Adam here. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. He hates the French, doesn't he? <laughs> okay, Lee. <laughs> Lee. Well, I don't know if this is right, it might be wrong. So what I'm going to go for oh, is... I know it. it's... It is... <laughs> Start the clock again. Can I go again? Yeah. It's me. Can we, can we not stop the clock? Beep! Beep! Stop the Beep! clock. Beep! Beep! Is it <laughs> Birmingham? <laughs> Renumbering. Numbering. Renumbering. No, it's numbering. Numbering. numbering that's what I meant. Numbering. Sorry. <laughs> 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 numbering. Sorry. Numbering. Sorry. As a stickler for the rules. <laughs> It's numbering or I'm having it. <laughs> it doesn't matter, we've won anyway, it doesn't matter because they can't capture us. Whatever, don't care. Who needs to have <laughs> Are we giving them the ten? Are we giving them the ten? <laughs> Says the referee finger that lives in his ear. If you, if you were in charge, it's the ten. Oh, you little finger. <laughs> Come on, give me a straight answer. <laughs> You'll go up the nose. <laughs> We don't need it, we're two points ahead. But Take your ten and stick it with the sun, don't shine. <laughs> Give me the hamper and let's just get the news on. <laughs> OK, Lee? 422. Lee! How did you do it? Right, you take that 422 at the top. <laughs> <laughs> Write that down, don't touch it with any of the other numbers. I haven't got anything again, you useless bitch! <laughs> I've been under a lot of stress <laughs> since she died. Well, oh, that was it, was it? I got nothing. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> 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 well, Lee, you Lee were writing the whole... stuff. You've put minus eight there, <laughs> 66 there you've got, <laughs> and 78. Where's that from? That's when she died. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think you're going to get the conundrum because I can't press my buzzer without fingering your dead now. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, but I'm just going to load my nan's dead skin dust off the monitor so I can see the conundrum. <laughs> Sorry, Dan, I'm just going to move you over there. So, Lee and Bob have no points, <laughs> still, none, oh. nothing. It's like they weren't here. And John <laughs> and Adam have 25.